In Person County, there is a petition circulating to get state legislators to change the law to allow for that. WNCN's Michael Highland has more. Courtney Henderson's two boys go to elementary school in Person County. Their safety for those hours they're out of her sight is something she worries about, especially in the wake of several mass shootings at schools across the country. It scares me to death to think that my children are growing up in a community, not a community, but in a world where people do these kinds of things. Bruce Wren shares that concern. He knows about security, selling electronic security systems at this business in Roxboro. His daughter graduated from Roxboro Community School. It's surrounded by barbed wire fencing and has other security measures in place. But still, he was worried. I worried about it every day, every single day. My wife and daughter didn't understand it, but I went down to that school almost every day and to make sure the back doors were locked, to make sure it was safe. His main concern, a gunman getting inside. But once you get beyond that, you know, somebody get, get beyond that, then what do you do? You know, you're, you're dealing with somebody with a gun and you have nothing. So he's circulating this petition, hoping state legislators will change the law to allow trained teachers to keep a gun in a secured place in their classrooms. He made his pitch to the Person County Board of Education Thursday, seeing if he'd get any support. Board members were silent. The chairman says it's not something they've seriously discussed. Personally, I think it would be a, a huge difference. It would be a mighty big item that would require a lot of thought, a lot of input. The country's largest teachers union, the National Education Education Association is strongly opposed to this idea, calling it dangerous. In a recent survey, the union says 68% of its members oppose it. But Wren says he'll keep pushing. You know, all these kids getting killed in schools with all this gun violence and all. And, uh, you know, we have all these gun free zones, and that gun free zones is not working. An NBC News investigation found 18 other states already allow teachers and other adults to carry a gun in school. Here in Person County, though, they don't plan to discuss this issue at any public meetings anytime soon. In Person County, Michael Hyland, WNCN News.